Number 37. Which base, CH3NH2 or CH32NH, is the stronger base? And then which conjugate acid, CH32NH2+, or CH3NH3+, is the stronger acid? Okie dokie. So, uh, in previous examples, we found out the KBs, and some of them were told us in, in the last, I think, two uh, questions, if you want to go check them out if you haven't already. Uh, what the KB values of the bases were. And then also, we also found out uh, what the conjugate acids were for the acids in question. So out of these, we just need to figure out which one is the stronger base and which one is the stronger acid. So let's work with the base first. So we have a KB value, an ionization constant for the base of 4.4 times 10 to the negative fourth for CH3NH2 and then 5.9 times n to the negative fourth for CH32NH. If you have the KB values, it's very, very, very simple. You just compare the two. The higher the KB, so the higher the KB value, that just means that you are increasing in basicity. So you're going to be a stronger base. So all we got to do is just figure out which one is the higher KB value. Well, out of 4.4 times 10 to the negative fourth and 5.9 times 10 to the negative fourth, this one, and I don't like that, <laughs> this one is the higher value, right? So if 5.9 times 10 to the negative fourth beats out 4.4 times 10 to the negative fourth, that means that CH32NH is a stronger base. So this guy. Now we just have to do the same thing for the KAs. So just like for KBs, an increase in KA just symbolizes that you're going to be more acidic. So your acidity will increase. So all we got to do is just look at these KA values. 2.3 times 10 to the negative 11th versus 1.7 times 10 to the negative 11th. This one, the top one, beats it out just by a little bit. 2.3 is bigger than 1.7. So this is the bigger number. And in that's the case, this conjugate acid is the stronger acid. And maybe in the other one, I should be more specific and say that this is the stronger base. And that's it. Pretty easy if you have the numbers. All you got to do is just compare them. Um, the one thing I do want to say, though, is you have to compare KB to KP. You can't compare a KB value with a KA. They have to be the same. But that's it. Hopefully this helped. Let me know in the comments. Subscribe to the channel. And I hope you're doing great out there. Let's keep studying hard. And good luck on your future tests and quizzes. I'll see you all later. Bye-bye.